finally arrived. It is here. Fallout 4. Wait, first let me go into Creation Club and see if I have everything that I need. Because I know I have a couple weapon mods and stuff. Ah. Feels nice being back in Fallout. Ah. Well, I guess I need to do this. Okay, looks like I did everything right now. Hope I did. Yes, I did. You can get huskies, border collars, and oh my god, I want this stuff. Adam Cat's armor. I don't think this counts as, um, hope it doesn't, I hope it doesn't count as, like, stuff, however you put it, mods, I just have to download this, okay. Well, it's nice to see everybody. This is SCP Crew. I'm sorry I forgot the intro. But yeah. I'm also sorry if I say, like, um, I'm ready to, like, I'm going to do this and then, like, the recording. And I, like, try to cut out the recording. And... Like, there's a little delay, and there's, like, just silence, or background sound. But yes. New game. Wait, do I have any continued games? Load games? Oh, yeah, that one. So let me delete this, so I can... Oh god, I have to delete it one by one. Well, I guess I'm gonna be deleting these, uh... Okay, we're gonna start a new game. And again, sorry for the delays and stuff. Of the, me shutting off the recording. So, here's the plan of my little wasteland adventure. My little wasteland wanderings. And, well, after I complete the main story, and really any side quest I feel fit, which I deem fit to do, um, then I'm probably going to, like, do the DLCs, which I'm having them installed. So, yes. And I'm gonna let the intro play out for itself when it loads when it loads please load god dang it okay My great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. 
Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. Okay, how did you guys like all that? I made sure to keep nice and quiet so that it didn't interrupt stuff. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. So I'm just gonna make my face off cam and... Okay, this is my dude. Um... If I feel like it, I should put a picture of me in there. And yes, I do have slightly a mustache. I couldn't find slight mustache in the options, so... I guess this, um, more than slight ah, mustache will do. Morning, Your coffee, you know, I, if I was living alone and didn't have standards for cussing, I would call you by a different name. I'm pretty sure you guys can guess what that is. New Coca-Cola, ice cold. Looks like the milk got delivered. He needs some milk. Saddle up Salisbury steak. Graded A+. Plus. I like Salisbury steak. It's good. My coffee. Oh, God, my mouth's burning. Codsworth, what did you do to this? Oh, I understand now. You have a flamethrower. You know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. Yeah, he's really good for a robot. Codsworth, let me in to see my child. Enjoy your coffee, sir. Cool, don't saw the baby in half. <clears throat> huh, here's this little punk. Leave me alone, your business is not wanted here. Okay, fine. Your business is Can you get that? Wanted, I guess. Good morning. Voltec calling. Good morning. Is it? Just look, Just look at that sky out there. <coughs> you can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Then I'm glad you caught up with me. Oh, me too. Okay, I think mistakes were made for my hairstyle. Now, I know you're a busy fellow. I mean, my mustache looks fine, but time being a a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance we, into the I shall, local vault. I shall skip this part because this part is boring. So, okay, so I guess this is 
One my thing. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for, and for the future. Oh, Thanks again. Thanks again. Don't care. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Oh my god, he calls me by my name. Mr. Nick. Thank you, Cosworth, for finally getting it right. Yeah, you just pet, just fiddle with your baby, and he'll he'll work for you. Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the <laughs> weather should hold up. I have yeah, no head. Sounds like fun. Come and see this. What's wrong? The world is detonating on TV. Followed by yes, my little British but robot butler. Not little, I mean you're, you're tall. We're, um, you're almost as tall as me. Confirmation. We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's um. Reports, My British robot reports, butler pal. You're good to me, bro. My God. You know, I'm ashamed of the name that oh I was we, thinking of. We need to get to the vault. Now! Yay, finally I can walk and run! Um, no. Soldier, this doesn't sound like a good idea. Sir, the oh my God! <laughs> I just died by nuclear explosion. Oh, and also maybe if I decide to, and my game doesn't let. Really, it's not me who decides if I want to do this next decision after I do all the DLCs and stuff. And also, this is not a blind playthrough. I've played this before in my spare time, before I even had a YouTube channel. You don't get in. I'm going in. You can't stop me. I would take the minigun bullets to the chest if, like, the if you're in the program, step forward. Otherwise, return home. We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male. How about you read it faster? <laughs> okay, go ahead. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna try to act like this was a blind playthrough and try to be the most humorous person I can now right now. And god dang it, I need to remember the controls. The platform, in the center. <laughs> Whee! I need to remember that X isn't how to jump anymore. God dang it, I'm having bad Almost there. whenever We're I gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh, sorry, I was looking at the wrong person. Um, don't take that wrong. Um, hold on. This person whose name I didn't catch, even though I know their name. Yeah, I can already see the glitches. This game is very glitchy, even without mods. Wait, I have mod. Do I have mods downloaded? Cause it has been very, very glitchy. Let me see if I have any mods. Okay. We did it. We made it. We're okay. So that was just like normal. Step off um, the elevator, fall out, glitches. No need to worry, folks. Don't worry, Everyone there's gonna be a lot of those, and it's gonna probably create some god funny moments. And it's weird. 
I have been recording this game, or I haven't been recording, but whenever I do not record, like before I even had a YouTube channel, this game was like mostly bug free until I downloaded mods. Then, and only then, did the game just like it glitched to crap. Oh, I'm supposed to follow this dude. We'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get. I want that thing on your arm. Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Decontamination chamber. Yes. Totally. I would actually think that this would kind of be cozy because I like cold stuff. But then again, you're being like frozen, frozen. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. And also, how's my character this stupid that he doesn't see like the freezing pipes, the the pipes being frozen over, and also the like mist, the freezing mist or whatever you call it. Wait, wait, woo, woo. <sighs> something, something suspended. You got suspended. <coughs> Whoever got suspended, I'm punching my way out of here. I'll punch my way out of here. Kellogg Frosted Flakes! <laughs> I love you, Kellogg. I love Kellogg Frosted. Actually, I haven't really had Kellogg Frosted Flakes. Oh, crap. I don't remember this in the cereal commercial. Hi, scientist person. Kellogg. And also, sorry for spoilers, because I can't help it but call him Kellogg. Well, we're probably going to learn about his name pretty early. He says we still have backup. I say, no. I say, homicidal rampage. <coughs> Which is the most thing, the most fun thing to go on in these games. Most stress relieving too. And also, cereal is good. And also, how does this dude fall over? He was standing up perfectly fine. Or was he sit? Or was he sitting down? Come on, come on, come on! Oh, God! Yeah, we're out of time. It failed. I'll find who did this. And I'll get you. I promise. I am running into doors and stuff. And also, I better collect all the loot I can in here. Or at least try <coughs> to. Take the screwdrivers. Take all the small additions. Okay, take up. Okay, pick up a cone. No, I can't. Can I open this thing? I, yes, I can. Can't access this. Screw you, Voltec. Screw you. Ah, yeah. My control saved over. It's a stim pack. I love those stim packs. Take those things and stim packs. 
Give me your. Oh wait a minute! I don't. This thing doesn't have the holo, hollow tape. Ooh. Ow! Die. Giant roaches. What the hell? Yes, Nate. Or Nick. Whatever I'm gonna call you. Ah, uh, yes, the recreations terminal. Please, Nick. Just sit down. I'll play the tape for a little bit. So you guys can see how bad I am at Donkey Kong. Or, wait a minute. Is it called Donkey... I'm pretty sure it's just called Donkey Kong. Not the, not the SNES version, the, the arcade. Okay, I'm done. Give me your hollow tape so I can play you on the go. Give me my baton. I hate how slow this thing swings. Epic combat. Like you have to gauge the amount of like time it spends, like takes to freaking swing the thing. Then again, in the middle of the thing, you can't even block. Wait, give me your meat. Oh Jesus Christ! Bum bum bum. Bum bum. Ching ching. What happened here? What happened Where here? Where is everyone? Everyone's dead. <laughs> Over CR's terminal. Open the frickin' tunnel. You don't have to give me the warning. You just tell me you're gonna do stuff. That's because I'm horrible at aiming. Bam! Bam! I missed. Give me your meat. Ugh. I hear crawlings. I hear crawlings around. I hear little skitter scatters. I don't know what's creepier. Small cockroaches or giant cockroaches? Both are equally terrifying. Especially the radioactive kind. Is this all that's left? Yes, it is, me. I should really stop calling him Nate and stop call and start calling him Nick. Why is my vision blurring? Has the radiation been getting to my mind? Sixty four K RAM system. <laughs> Good. <sighs> it's nice to be back. Mm. 
default door cycling sequence initiated. Please stand back. Hi. Uh, it's been a nice time. It's been nice and wonderful, and my mom has brought root beer. This time has never been greater. The times have never been greater. Welcome, people, to Fallout. Sorry if I gush over this game, but I love this game. When I was like 11, I used to play the heck out of this game. And though everything is not perfect, most Bethesda games aren't because they lag a bunch. This one, it's still good. Bethesda make Fallout 5! You don't have to though. So, I think I'm gonna call this an episode.